Hey, what's going on guys? It is Last here. Welcome to the second part of our little Q&A session. Uh, there will be a link down below in the description to the first part of this video that I uploaded a few days ago if you want to know the answers to 10 different questions about me. So, first off, if you guys are looking to buy any coins, then go and check out the thefifashop.co.uk. As always, guys, the links are going to be down below for you in the description. Uh, and if you guys could, uh, if you enjoy it, please do smash a like on the video. 2,000 likes would be amazing and I'd really appreciate it. So, without further ado, let us get into uh, the second part of the Q&A session. Monkey Gaming has asked, what do you hate most about FIFA? Uh, I really hate that you can build sweaty, overpowered pace teams and they can absolutely annihilate teams with people like Ronaldo, Messi, stuff like that. It just doesn't seem fair that uh, you could be buying these players that cost hundreds of thousands, even millions of coins. Uh, yet if you build a Bundesliga sweat team with Aubameyang or a Serie A sweat team with Ibarbo, they can just absolutely annihilate it. I just don't I don't find that fun, really. Scott Jameson asks again, favourite player of all time? Now, this is a really tough one for me because I've got two players in my head. And those two players are the real Ronaldo, so the Brazilian Ronaldo, uh, and Zinedine Zidane. I don't know if there's any chance that I could pick between the two. Uh, I just... Just back from my childhood, absolutely love both of those players. Uh, they are without doubt two of the best players to ever grace a football pitch. Uh, Ronaldo could just finish the ball so well, was so rapid, so good on the ball. Uh, and then Zidane just absolutely bossed whenever he played. I just loved, loved, loved watching him. If you guys haven't ever really seen them play, I highly recommend you guys go and watch some highlight videos on YouTube because... You're missing out, man. They were absolutely just the best thing to ever happen to football. Henry Cowling asks, on a scale of 1 to 10, what is your favourite colour of the alphabet? I like turtles. Craig Maxwell asks, favourite players, cards from each ultimate team? FIFA 11 was the first one I played, so I'd say Ronaldo and Ibra. Uh, FIFA 12, I would probably say Ibra and Ronaldo. Uh, FIFA 13, I'm going to go out and say Ronaldo and Ibra. Um, and FIFA 14, I'm going to say Ronaldo and Ibra um, and Rude Hullet. Adam asks, when you started YouTube, did you ever expect to come this far? No, not in a million years that I think that I would ever get anywhere near even like 100,000 subscribers uh, or even like 10,000 subs. I, I just love doing the whole video editing and stuff uh, and just playing games, making videos. So for it actually to have kind of worked for me is just unbelievable and I'm really, really thankful for you guys. Guiana asks, would you rather eat a snake or a dog? Um, well, that's a really random question and I think... I think eating a dog is like, a dog's a pet, so you couldn't eat that, like, even though there's probably a bit more meat on it than there is a snake, I'm going to have to say a snake, because it seems less like a pet to me. Nathan Williamson asks, what would you do if you won the lottery, and would you go public about it, or would you keep it to yourself? If I won the lottery, I think the first thing I would do is probably go out to the nearest Ferrari garage, and um, just load myself up with a fucking awesome car. Uh, and then I'd probably, I'd, I'd keep it on the down low for a little bit, right? And what I would do is I'd buy like a really expensive car, like a Ferrari or a Lamborghini or something crazy. Uh, and I would drive it around to like each of my individual like friends houses. Uh, and then I'd say, you know what, look, I just won the lottery. Here's a car. Uh, and then surprise each and every one of them. And then it would like be public knowledge. Uh, and then I'd just go and live on the beach somewhere in the Caribbean or by my own island or something crazy. I love to get caught up in uh, in this thinking of lottery winnings because it's just a dream. It's never, ever going to happen, you know. Oh, I'd love it though, wouldn't you? Harry asks, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Siri, how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Don't you have anything better to do? <laughs> Scott Wilson asks, if you could get stuck on an island with one YouTuber, one celebrity, and one item, who and what would you choose? 
Right then, so if I had to choose a YouTuber or a YouTube channel, I'm going to take Epic Meal Time with me because there's no way we're going to go hungry on that island then. Uh, so that's that's that bit sorted. Uh, now I've got to choose a an item to take with me. I'll probably take a football so that you can just sort of play football on the beach, not get bored, you know. That would be quite fun. Uh, and then the final, the celebrity. Um, I'm going to take Melanie Iglesias. Now, that, there's just obvious reasons why you guys can sit there and think about that to yourselves Jamie asks lastly what is your subscriber goal now I never really know how to answer this scenes as I never thought anything like would ever happen this much like I didn't think I'd ever get anywhere near the 170 odd thousand of you guys that are there today uh, but now that it's sort of happened and whatnot I guess I guess 1 million subscribers is my eventual goal. God knows if it would ever, ever happen. I doubt it will ever happen. Um, but that's that's my goal now. Now that we've surpassed the really difficult task of sort of, you know, getting a few thousand subscribers to becoming one of the bigger FIFA channels in the community and stuff, i got to say, I want one of them gold play buttons from YouTube. I want a million subs. Now, whether that would ever happen, I doubt it. But still, it's good to dream uh, and good to hope that something like that could happen. Uh, so that has been the final question of the Q&A. If you have enjoyed, guys, please do uh, let me know down in the comments. You know, drop a comment for me and smash that like button as well. Uh, I thank you guys for watching so much and I will catch you next time. Peace.